start with, let's look at the Compass Monitor security system that is standard on the machines. Looking at the security system on the Compass Monitor, which is available on the E-Series and the E2 machines, it is as standard from the 3.5 through to the 8-ton machine. With the security system, it will not come installed on the machine. So if you turn the key on and the gauges jump up straight away, you know there's no security system. You can install the security system yourself very simply by going into the menu, going into service, putting in the service code, and once you are into the service mode, you will go down to security system. Once you select security system, it will show it's not installed. We'll say OK and you've got two options. It's not installed, which is how it currently is, or you install it with options or with no options. If you install it with no options, you will need to input the four digit security code each and every time you start the machine. If you install it with options, which is what we're going to do, you will be able to select unlimited when you get out of the machine or you will be able to lock the machine up. So it gives you options on how you use that security system on the day to day basis. So you see when we turn the machine off we can put it to one minute to lock it in one minute's time. So by the time you exit the machine, lock the door, get into your truck, the machine will be locked and will re require a code to access the machine once again. If I hit unlimited, then it means I can start the machine as many times as I wish during the course of the day by just turning the key on in the normal way. When you consider how many times we get on and off a machine on a job site on a daily basis, this is a very beneficial to have, still have a key start system on the machine. However, if we want to lock the machine up at lunch, we just hit one minute and away we go. So once this time when we put on the security the key, the security system will come up. You'll see the cat logo, you'll see the padlock this time, and it will show that the machine is unlocked and ready to start. If I'd selected one minute, then the system would have come up with the padlock locked and I'd needed to have input a four digit code to start the machine.